is a stormtrooper on his own layer. And I've added a shadow behind him. Click the link to see how to add wall and ground shadows. I want to clone a row of him in perspective going down this corridor. Start by opening the clone source panel. Switch to the clone tool and make sure it's set to sample just the current layer. Choose a large brush and I want to align it with the point where the shadow meets the bottom of the wall. Hold Option or Alt and click the starting point. Go to where you want it to appear and just dab once to fix it in that location. In the clone panel, uncheck this clipped checkbox. And now the overlay shows the full image. We now need to scale the copy to the correct size. Select the size and use the up and down cursor keys to make this value larger and smaller. And a value of about 89% looks good in this case. But we need him to appear behind the previous Stormtrooper. Check the clipped button again so the preview only appears under the brush location. Let's undo that previous operation. So we get rid of that first dab and now change the mode of this tool from normal to behind. Start painting and you'll see how he does indeed appear behind the original. Let's put the clone source panel away. There's our second Stormtrooper. And we can carry on cloning. It'll now copy the second version. With each new painting stroke, it'll add another Stormtrooper going all the way down the corridor. If you've enjoyed this tutorial, please subscribe to this channel.